Hi everyone, welcome to the Droid G channel. Today's video will explain to you how to unlock Samsung phone forgot password. Setting a password can make Samsung phones more secure, so many people are used to setting passwords. However, sometimes people forget their passwords, which can lead to problems. Currently, many users are looking for an effective and efficient way to unlock Samsung phones that have forgotten their password. You can learn through this video, how to unlock Samsung phone when you forgot password. This video is applicable to Samsung mobile phone models including Samsung Galaxy S23 series, Galaxy Z Flip 5, Galaxy Z Fold 5, A series, and Galaxy S22 series. Please be patient and watch this video, I believe it will help you solve the problem of how to unlock Samsung phone forgot password. Almost all Samsung phones have built-in lock screen settings, through which we can set passwords, patterns, security pins, and even fingerprints. This blocks unwanted access to protect our privacy. So how do you get into your Samsung phone if you forget your password, pin or pattern lock? Or you put your Samsung phone in your pocket and find that the screen is locked when you take it out? At this time you may know your Samsung phone unlock password, but you cannot enter the correct password on the phone screen. Now how do I remove a password from my lock screen? Or maybe you have lost the lock screen password of your old Samsung phone. How to do hacking and bypassing Samsung phone password If you have forgotten your Samsung phone security password and are unable to access your device, how can you unlock a Samsung phone that you forgot your password? We've found a few easy ways to unlock your Samsung phone. Now, please join me to learn how to unlock phone of forgot password Samsung, and please join me step by step to try the method of unlocking a locked Samsung phone in the video. If you think this video is good, you can subscribe like or leave a message to tell us which method helped you solve the problem. Method 1 is to use your fingerprint unlock or face recognition to unlock your phone. How to unlock your Samsung phone if you forgot the password. As long as you meet the requirements, you can get into your Samsung phone without an unlock code. Two features available on modern Samsung phones are fingerprint unlocking and face recognition unlocking. At this point you can use one of these two methods to unlock your Samsung phone. This method is simple and very efficient. When you need to use your fingerprint unlock or face recognition to unlock your Samsung phone, your Samsung phone must have set one of them before forgetting the password. In the video, I set up fingerprint unlocking. Now you need to wait for the lock countdown to end. After finishing, turn on the Samsung phone, and the fingerprint unlocking position will be displayed on the screen of the Samsung phone. You only need to place the phone you set up for fingerprint unlocking in the Samsung phone screen unlock position. At this time, your phone will be unlocked and returned to the home screen without losing any data. How to unlock Samsung phone without fingerprint. Similarly, if you set up face unlock instead of fingerprint unlock, please wait for the lock countdown to end and place the phone directly parallel to your eyes. If there is no accident, your Samsung phone will unlock to the home screen. Method 2 is to use smart lock to access locked phone. The smart lock function on Samsung phones can unlock Samsung phones without a password. If you have enabled the smart lock feature on your phone before the Samsung phone is locked, it allows the device owner to unlock the Samsung phone in a trusted location, near a trusted device, and on body detection. So, how to unlock Samsung phone when password is forgotten with smart lock. If you've set up smart lock to use your home address as a trusted location, you can take your phone home and it will automatically unlock whenever you're near that address, without an unlock code. If you set up a Samsung phone to be unlocked near a trusted device, then the locked Samsung phone will be unlocked near the trusted device. If you set up on body detection, the locked Samsung phone can be unlocked normally as long as it is close to your body or the temperature reaches the unlocking standard. Method 3 is Samsung's Find My Phone service to unlock your phone without a password. Samsung phones have a Find My Phone feature that allows you to remotely manage your device if you lose it, including the ability to unlock Samsung phone passwords. If you enabled Samsung's Find My Phone before losing your password, you will be able to use it to remotely unlock your Samsung phone without password. First, Make sure your Samsung phone is logged into a Samsung account before it is locked and must have a Wi-Fi or mobile data connection. After your phone is connected to Wi-Fi or mobile data connection, please turn on your computer. Next we need to use the computer to reset the phone password through Find My Phone. Please follow the steps below. Open a search engine on your computer, navigate to findmymobile.samsung.com, and log into your Samsung account on the web login page. After logging in, your device information will be displayed in the upper left corner of your computer display. Please check whether your device information is correct on your computer. If it is not the Samsung phone you want to unlock, please find and select the Samsung phone you need to unlock in the upper left corner. The upper right corner is the functional area, which includes locking, unlocking, etc. Today we are using the unlock function, which can unlock the Samsung mobile phone password without restoring factory settings. Please find and click the unlock icon in the functional area. After clicking, a secondary confirmation pop-up box will appear. In the pop-up box, 
you will be asked to confirm whether you need to unlock your phone again. Please click unlock in the secondary pop-up box. After clicking, please wait patiently for the computer and mobile phone to respond. At this time, you can pay attention to whether your mobile phone has bypassed the lock screen. Once completed, all screen locks on your phone, including pattern locks, pins, passwords, and biometric information will be removed. The Samsung phone will automatically return to the home screen. Please turn on your phone to check whether the phone is unlocked successfully. Method 4 is to use Google Find My Device to unlock your phone without password. If you are still unable to unlock your Samsung phone, you can use the Google Find My Device website to reset your device to factory settings to resolve Samsung phone without passcode. Remember, factory resetting your device will return your device to its original factory condition. Google has a free service called Find My Device that unlocks your Samsung phone without a password. If you need to use Google Find My Device to solve the problem of forget password on Samsung mobile phones, first, you need to use your computer to visit google.com slash android slash device manager. In Google Find My Settings you need to log in to your Google account. Log in to your Google account. Additionally, you need to turn on your Samsung phone location and connect to a data network or Wi-Fi. After completing the above steps, please find and confirm your Samsung mobile phone information on the computer screen. There will be three options on the left side of the computer screen, ring, lock, and erase. The function we are using today is the erase function. The erase function will completely clear the information on your Samsung phone. If there is necessary data in the Samsung phone, please back up the data first and then erase the data. Next, please click to erase the device. After clicking, the page will jump and the login interface will appear. At this time, you need to log into your Google account again. Please enter your Google account and password and click confirm. After the login is completed, the page will jump back to the Google Find My Settings page. Here, please click Erase Device again. Erase Device may require you to wait patiently for a while. While waiting for Erasure, please note whether your Samsung phone is preparing or undergoing a reset. After the reset is complete, your Samsung phone will display the interface you used when you first opened the phone when you purchased it. Later, if you need to set a new Samsung lock screen password, remember the password and write it down in a safe place to avoid the forgotten Samsung phone passcode problem again. Method 5 is to restore the factory settings and unlock the phone without a password. If the prerequisites of the above method cannot be met, how to unlock Samsung phone without passcode? Don't worry, you can also try the last step you can do, restoring factory settings can unlock Samsung phone problems. If you need the data on your phone, back up all your data first. Next. Please follow the steps below to restore your phone to factory settings. Connect your phone to your computer. Then, make sure your phone is turned off and wait at least 30 seconds. Next, press the volume up button and power button simultaneously until you see the recovery mode screen. From the recovery screen of your Samsung phone, select wipe data slash factory reset using volume buttons and press the power button to confirm. Then, select factory reset using the volume buttons and confirm by selecting the yes option using the volume buttons. This will trigger the reset process, which should only take 2 to 3 seconds to complete. Once completed, it will take you back to the same recovery mode. Use the power button to select the restart system now option. Finally, your phone will open and reboot to the home screen, which will appear as it did when you first opened the phone when you purchased it. At this point your Samsung phone has cleared all data, which is consistent with the erasure function in Google Find My Device, and the Samsung forgotten password problem will no longer exist. Finally. Please reset your Samsung phone password and save it in an important place to reduce the risk of forgetting your Samsung phone password. Method 6 is to seek professional help. If you have tried all the above methods and still cannot log into your Samsung phone normally, then take your phone to a repair center and let a professional check it and get your Samsung phone home screen. Finally, I would like to remind you that if you set a password for your Samsung phone, you can keep your Samsung in a safe place, or set a password that is easy to remember and meaningful. That's it for today's video. If you think this video is helpful to you and think we did a good job, please like and share it and tell us which method helped you solve the problem in the message area. At the same time, if you think there is anything we need to improve, you can also express your opinions and suggestions in the message area. Thanks. Good luck.